Hunter, let's catch up. Salutations, Hunter. How is the sample analysis going? Oh, you mean the vial of demonic alien goo Peter took out of poor Eddie. That sample analysis? That is the one. In a word, gross. But a fascinating kind of gross. This symbiote exists as a whole at the molecular level. Every atom of it is a self-sustaining, slimy little entity in and of itself. Yet when the molecules bond, they undergo a change state that can only be described as something out of abstract expressionism, and I can see your eyes glazing over right now. I am sure this makes sense to you, but try to remember I am not from this time. I am still getting used to the idea of lights that turn on when you flip a switch. <laughs> right. I will slow down a bit, skip the science babble, and get right to the point. I think we can use Venom's slime sample as the basis of a suit. Like a Venom suit? No, not like Venom. No symbiosis. It would exist as an anti-symbiote to protect you the next time you two meet. Think of it as a kind of armor. Strange and I are working on a design right now. Give me 24 hours, and I think you'll be very pleased. Oh, you are gonna love this. Uh, give me a sec. Okay, what's up? What can I say, except you're welcome? Another magical mystery box. And to think, I used to design sentient future tech. Tony is working. Until next time. No, absolutely not. You go too far, Nico. Last time you tried to save Wanda, you almost got us all kicked. I will not let you risk the safety of this abbey again. Listen to yourself. I think I have a way of purifying Lilith's corruption, a way of bringing back both Wanda and Banner, and your response is to shut me down. I told you time and time again, there is no way of removing corruption. Just because you failed and never found a way of doing it doesn't mean I can't. What are you so afraid of, that I'll actually succeed? No, I'm afraid you're becoming just like Wanda. Oh, I see how it is. You always hated her, and now you're gonna turn that hate on to me, too. That's not what I meant. Nico, wait. Let me explain. I don't need your explanation. I need you to stay out of my way. Now we're getting somewhere. I'm just twiddling. Bye. You have any ideas on how to keep this team from unraveling? Because I'd love to hear them. I'm at my wit's end, Hunter. Nico is hell-bent on finding some spell in Wanda's grimoire to remove Lilith's hold on our... <sighs> unfortunate friends. And I can't seem to dissuade her from putting our lives in danger again. You would think she would have learned her lesson with that magic mirror trick she pulled, but now she's just doubling down on darkness. What do you think I should do about her? Because I am at a complete loss. Have you considered that she may be onto something? And maybe you should trust her? Why? So she can get us all killed? Nico lost her trust with me the moment she went behind my back and tried to rescue Wanda with you and the others. I simply cannot afford to trust her again. 
Not until she demonstrates that she's willing and able to cast spells responsibly. Nico is a talented witch, no doubt, but if she persists on this trajectory, she will suffer the same fate as Wanda. Perhaps you can talk her down. She's more likely to listen to you than me. Thanks, Hunter. I don't scare that easily. Nico is certainly as daring as caretaker is cautious. Attempting to remove Lilith's corruption is not a magical endeavor for the faint of heart. Is it even possible to remove it? I'm not sure, actually. It's something I should do a little research on. But if it is, one thing is for sure. All magic has its price. The question is, are you willing to pay it to help get Wanda back? I am not so much concerned with what toll this magic could take on me, but on Nico. I do not want to see her fall. But you should be concerned with how this will affect you. I know I am. You are more vulnerable than you know. The crack in your collar may be hardly noticeable to the naked eye, but it's a significant crack in your energetic armor. A spiritual vulnerability that cannot be overlooked or understated. A vulnerability she will exploit. If you choose to defy Sarah and help Nico remove Lilith's hold on Wanda, it might be at your own peril. It might be at my own peril, but none of us know for sure. I mean, we do not even know if purifying corruption is possible. I'm sorry if I made you worry, dear. That wasn't my intention. Whatever happens, Hunter, just remember to keep yourself intact. We can't take on Lilith without you. Back again. We've got plenty of tricks for old dogs. No excuses here. This will make a difference. Hydra won't want to tussle with me now. And just sit back. Always improvements to be made. Not everyone wants my advice, but they're gonna get it either way. We need any advantage we can get. Constant innovation. That's the stark promise. Later. See you around. Let me guess. You came out here to see if I'm okay. Are you okay, Nico? No, I won't be okay until we get Wanda back, but you already know that. I just wish Caretaker trusted me more. I mean, I'm not a kid, you know? I'm a ridiculously experienced witch with ridiculously amazing powers. 
She should be letting me use my talents to help the team, but instead all she does is doubt my ability to do anything. Caretaker is allowing her fear to get the better of her. Huh? What, why should she be afraid of me? I'm on her side. Because like you said, you are a ridiculously experienced witch with ridiculously amazing powers. My guess is she fears you might follow in Wanda's footsteps if given free reign. Oh, she's always hated her. No, Nico. She just fears her. She fears any power she cannot control. I think it has to do with what happened to Lilith. She thinks we're gonna end up like Lilith? What a vote of confidence. To be fair, Wanda has already fallen. That wasn't her fault. I'm gonna do whatever it takes to get her back. And when Caretaker tries to stop you? She can get out of the way. Or get run over. Now excuse me, I've got a free Wanda spell to craft. It's good to have you around again. Hello. I will post about this on my socials. And I might embellish a teensy. Magic, do you consider yourself Russian? First, what country can you say you belong to? I have never paid much attention to borders and flags. I am the same way. Living in Hell's antechamber alters your perspective on the folly of nations. What would you do if a country took issue with you? Huh, move my candy stockpile to limbo. Then wait until it all blew over. I'm not smiling. I am pleasantly surprised. We shall be reunited soon. I cannot help but feel excitement. We are standing in front of each other right now. Not here, but in the physical realm. You don't need to be coy. I know you are coming. To where exactly? The Sanctum Santorum. The prophecy advances. As much as it will please me to see you, I beg you not to stand in my way. I cannot guarantee your safety this time. You are right, Mother. The prophecy is advancing, and we shall halt it at all costs. I admire your conviction, child. There may come a time when we will stand in defiance of destiny. But it is not now. I have said all I can. It is out of my hands now. Actually, it seems to be all in your hands. I wish that were so. But you know the truth. He is closer than ever before. Who is? I would not dare say his name in this place. Still, he will bring us together after so long. Is it selfish of me to say that it's our reunion that matters most?
Something has changed with you, Hunter. I can sense it. Agatha? It's all right, child. You have been through so much. Your mother is calling you back to her. Trying to break anything that stands between you. I'm frightened of what will happen if this collar breaks. That's because it's unknown. Even with all my knowledge from beyond the grave, I cannot tell you what will happen. But I have faith in your ability to overcome whatever obstacle Lilith throws at you. Your ancestral powers are awakening and taking root. They would be pleased you are choosing the angels of your better nature. But the real question is, are you pleased? Is this the path you want to continue to walk? Yes, Agatha. This path pleases me. I am confident that the only thing that can defeat darkness is the blinding brilliance of light. Then shine it. Drown out your mother's shadow. I intend to. Just remember, whoever you choose to be, I accept you. some more wards I could place on it if I can just get time. Hunter, what you've got there is the latest in custom alloy, handcrafted, magically protected personal protective gear. Yes, thanks to the symbiote sample young Mr. Parker recovered, we were able to isolate the alien energy signature that appeared to be causing you so much trouble. With this armor, you should now be able to get close enough to Venom to take him down. This time without, you know, exploding. It feels good. Now just get me back to New York and I will handle the rest. I could not have predicted this outcome, but it is intriguing. Welcome to Tony's Scary Demon Cave. I'm Tony, and how may I assist you today? Tony's Forge of Mystery, we never close. Genius Inventor strikes again.
want to share something with you. Something I have never shared with another. Magic, I... When I was at Professor Xavier's school, I would listen to this album in my room all the time. Sometimes for many days straight. After your time in Limbo, music must have been a revelation. It was a lifeline, but it made me no friends. I prefer to listen in solitude, as I always have. You are not alone now. Good, you noticed. The others would not understand. But I know you will, as we both have so much in common. I suppose we are kindred spirits in a way. Of course. We are both children of darkness who escaped our destinies and decided to forge new ones. We are both reformed, trying to be good guys now, even if we do not always succeed. It's nice to have someone to relate with. It is, is it not? Okay, enough talking. Let's listen to the album now. The second hour is when it really gets good. The new outfit looks spectacular. Just really badass. Uh, oh, thank you. It's amazing what a little teamwork can produce. Teamwork? Oh, you mean stark and strange. They finally got along enough to make this. I just hope it's enough to stop Venom. Since sitting here and not doing anything is not an option, I guess we will soon find out whether it was enough. You don't seem to be too concerned about your own safety. A few days ago, I was dead. Anything else is an improvement. Oh, good point. I could discuss this armor all day, but... Oh, I know. You've got a date with a symbiote. Don't let me stand in the way. Good luck out there. What do you think about Hunter's armor? Looks slick, huh? What's new, Hunter? Beginning decryption sequence. We're ready to make a move. If I had time, I'd take care of these myself. But I have been accused of hogging the ball before. Happy to help. Still no sign of Venom. The Parker Boy really came through. Even with his disappearance, his pet symbiote has unfortunately not given up its taste for my sanctum. Neither has Hydra. They've upped the guard again, which I didn't even think was possible. This symbiote creature has had a stranglehold on us long enough. It is time to strike. Are you sure that thing is safe? Well, we didn't exactly have a manual, but the science and spooky bits are sound. You should be well protected. It's a big risk. So is leaving Lilith in command of the Sanctum. You're both right. But I bet you have another option. Sorry, didn't mean to spoil your moment. A frontal assault has too many variables, but there's always the hole. The back door. Of course. I know the risks, but at some point we have to start believing in each other. In ourselves. Your design will hold. We would never let you step into battle unprepared. Besides, 
What was the first rule of demon hunting you taught me? If at first you don't succeed, stab, stab, stab again. again. Aw, you think Reed and Sue have such heartwarming moments with Johnny and Ben? <laughs> We're gonna get the Sanctum back for Strange. I like your optimism. I have a good feeling. I wish we had more time to test Strange and Stark's monstrosity of a creation. But with Venom out of the picture, even temporarily, we need to strike now while we still have the chance. symbiote. Now you'll just have to do it a few more times. Oh, and try not to bring the roof down on your heads in the process. I think I can hear Strange grimacing through the radio.
Hydra sure does get around. Are we sure they don't have a window here? It's action movies right now, but go! Get to the safe zone! Excitement, I guess. A little sorcerer returns home. Can't say I like what you've done with the place, demon mother, or my friend. No matter. Already, the power of the sanctum returns to me. Your days of plundering its secrets end today! But that was never the plan. Now. Yes, mother. themselves. If we are to have any chance of stopping Lilith, we must interrupt her mystic's ritual and seal that breach. Temporary. 
They deserve no mercy. Let's give it a go. It's for the best, trust me. Their mystics fall before us. Watch and learn, my friends. I saw a move like that once, centuries ago. Your efforts will never deter me. Show the servants of Lilith any mercy. My blade certainly will not. Nice. A little less friendly than my neighborhood, but uh, gets the point across. Carol would be so proud of you right now. Weak, even for Hydra. on that. You'll feel better. Your time has come. You are lucky to still be breathing. You have earned this. Was that truly your best? Regroup and position turned on. It will all be over soon. I know I'm new to this old prophecy game, Doc, but none of this is good, is it? No, there it is not. the situation. I will be... What? Two steps behind us? I've seen too many movies to fall for that one. I'm staying. As am I. Okay, I'm just gonna say it. That really, really sucked. Try adding a few dozen more reallys. I'm in shock. I... I didn't expect to lose the Sanctum. Oh, you didn't expect to lose the Sanctum? That was my whole life. Ripped open and decimated before my eyes. We need to have a serious conversation about Lilith. She's much stronger than we anticipated. We did everything we could and it still wasn't enough. Uh, Lilith is a pain, for sure. But right now, she's hiding behind our boy Bruce. And if he's giving her IT advice, then that's a problem I can do something about. I failed. How else can I describe it? I failed not just my teammates, but the world. That's right. You did fail. All of you. Oh, hey, don't sugarcoat it or anything. But that doesn't mean you lost. And that is an important distinction. 
This war is far from over, and tomorrow we will rise again, and fight again. I'm too tired for a hoorah, but the sentiment is there. I appreciate the inspirational words. We all need it. I'm sure. Now rest, get some sleep. All of you, the battle will wait until morning. <laughs>